am a very ritualistic person, so to bring the water and the ritual together is very special. And to demarcate, for me, monthly, the cycles that happen in my marriage. And every month is different, actually. And so in some ways there are things that are just the same, but then every month is very specific of what's going on in my life and it allows me this sacred moment to stop and review and connect with God in this beautiful ritual in the water way for me is just perfect. I love my pain because when I guide on a Tuesday, it brings out the spirituality that I can never find anywhere else. Just walking down the pathway into the building, it just makes me think of all the people we touch and all the people that come there. It means so much to me to be able to help these people feel comfortable. For my Bat Mitzvah project, I volunteered at Mayim Chaim, Living Waters Community Mitzvah, and Paula Brody and Family Education Center. Mayim Chaim is a place where people of different backgrounds can come together and immerse in the holy water for their own reasons. During my time at Mayim Chaim, I studied with my peers, created a Bat Mitzvah recognition gift for use at Mayim Chaim, wrote my own ritual for immersion, immersed in the mikvah, and did countless loads of holy laundry. He named me. Just stuffing envelopes. I love, I love being. I love the light coming in. I just love. It is a special there. place, and Amy is a special lady, and that's why I am here. <laughs> that is why I'm here. I love my Haim because they know how to combine culture, spirit, the arts, and a lot of soul. So today, to renew my connection with my husband, to remember our connection and our closeness. Also, um, three weeks ago today, I got a phone call from my, not from my dad, about my dad that he didn't wake up and um, he had a series of many, many strokes that didn't allow him to wake up. So he was in a coma for five days and he is alive now, but he doesn't know who I am. So this is a different moment in my life. Yeah. And it's not like last month or the month before. And so, in connecting to God in the water, I'm saying special prayers of healing for my father. And even though I go monthly and from the outside it might look like it's the same thing, it's very different this month. Mm. Of maybe connecting with his spirit, since I can't really connect with him in this plane, he doesn't, I don't think he knows who he is. And so it feels like a special mikvah today. <laughs> so, uh, thank you all for being here, by the way. This is a great event. Um, what I love about my Chaim is the sounds. The sounds of laughter, the sounds of tears, the sounds of new babies in the family, and the sounds of your laughter here tonight. So, yay! yay. <laughs> My name.